isn't a trick. This screen is meant to be twisted, bent, even rolled up. Startup Polyera spent 10 years developing the new technology. The real breakthrough is what's behind the screen. How do you make the screens that you produce bend? So what we do is we start with new electronic materials and actually what you see beside you is a bottle of these electronic materials. But we can then actually use traditional fabrication processes to turn those into the building blocks of electronics. And so these are transistors and they are highly flexible, also highly mechanically robust to things like impact. It's not bending the screen that's the hard part, it's everything that's in the screen. That's what's hard to make bend. It's all those layers of different materials and some of the hardest materials are the electronically active materials to make bend. The bendable display uses black and white e-paper technology, which is thin, durable, and energy efficient. When you set out to do this, did you have some type of goal in mind about bending screens? The vision was really that the majority of electronic devices we surround ourselves with are what I call rigid bricks. And what I thought would be that if we could allow these to be softer, more flexible in form factor, it would allow all sorts of new experiences and devices to be created. What are some ideas you have for products that could be transformed because the technology inside them is bendable? Do you have any kind of wild ideas? What we're focused on uh, right now is actually looking at the wearable sector. I think about these displays as being a type of digital fabric and it allows you to create all sorts of devices, wearables or accessories or others, where you can change the surface at the touch of an interface. Now Polyera is putting the screens to use in a wearable it calls the Wove Band, slated to roll out next year. What's your vision for Wove for this band? Well, the Wove Band is going to incorporate a display much like the one I showed you. Here you see an early stage prototype. This is uh, the device in a flat state, but you can change its shape and actually put it around your wrist. I'm going to change the image on it. It's also fully touch active. The entire surface is touch capacitive. And so, so you just touched it and now there's something new displayed. Is exactly. That the time, there's or? a time and here there's a couple of blocks of information. In this case, weather and use headlines. But of course, you could customize it and have, you know, all sorts of content. And we really like to think about, you know, combining useful and beautiful content. No wearable has become mainstream yet. And even if Wove doesn't, the technology behind it may bend our future.